It's like saying the letter K, like K, K, but you kind of say it inward. What are some of like the basic sounds? Could you give us examples of, of those? So the basic or fundamental sounds are your typical drum kit. So you've got like the kick drum, right? Or the hi-hat or like a snare. So like, or so if you put them together, just simply it's a so something like that. I can't believe that sound comes out of your mouth. And that's a compliment, right? Like that was so clean and clear and sounded like the instrument that you were imitating that my mouth just dropped. I was like, holy, how the hell do you do that? Well, for one, lots of lots of work. I, I practice, you know, every day pretty much. But um, to, to give a quick breakdown of the, the those simpler sounds uh, for your kick, you just want to, uh, it's like saying the letter B. So B, B, and then you push really hard with your lips. So instead of B, you put a lot of pressure, B, B, B. And then you remove uh, your vocals from it. So, and that's a kick. And then your hi hat, similar, but with the letter T. So T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T sounds okay is it that hard to learn how to do it or is it maybe just me that like i have i have no musical talent so to me you might as well be inventing a rocket ship right like i (laughs) is it that hard to do or is it just like man you got it or you kind of don't i think anybody can learn those those sounds it might take a lot of work uh, because for some people, you know, it clicks more than others. Like just like anything else, right? Whereas it, it for some people, they just they they their brain understands it easier, and they're able to pick up uh, pick it up quicker. But I, I believe that those those beginning sounds are, are sounds that everybody is like physically capable of doing. Like you, you can you can eventually do it with enough practice. Um, there are certain sounds that I feel like, like, you know, there's just like some only, like only like randomly, just some people can, can just do it and some people can't because like only a small number of people in the community know how to do those sounds. But um, I think more or less people can, anybody can learn. You can figure it out, right? Like if you did it enough, you're eventually going to be able to do it. You mentioned before, like, making a sound with your nose. I don't even know how to do that. Like, what's a sound that you would make with your nose? Um, mm. So is, there's a few sounds that, that are like that. And then there's actually a couple sounds that are, like, through your nose. Like, you know, like, you know, when you snore, some people use that sound in, in a beat. So, like, you know, like, that. like I, I don't I don't really use that sound, but that, that's that's a sound that, that people use that, that comes from your nose. Hardest sound to make, easiest sound to make. Uh, hardest sound. Let's see if I can do it right now. <clears throat> that one's pretty hard because uh, sometimes it just doesn't doesn't land it like that. Uh, easiest sound to make, hi hat. Is do you have a signature sound? Yeah. Uh, it was probably that one I did earlier. The like at. Yeah, that probably, probably that one. Is it uh, is it an open secret, or is it very secretive? Like how how you make those sounds? I mean, I could tell you, but I don't know if you didn't really understand everything. But I could I could. I'd actually like to the, hear the, the explanation just to see how much I don't understand it. Almost. So the first sound, it's a it's a combination of, uh, like three 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 layers basically. So the first sound, underneath all of it is inward bass which is it's a bass created by breathing in that's why it's called inward bass so it's like 
you know, ha, ha, ha. That's the, that's the sound. So it's like <gasps> kind of like you're breathing in and you're kind of getting this, this sort of, you know, vibration in your throat. But that's the first sound. So, <laughs> and then on top of that, it's vocalized. So, you know, if you went, you know, if you just hum, right? Mm. But if you do that like inward, so, mm, 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 ah, ah, ah. so that on top of it, so it's, and then on top of that, there's another sound. It's called a siren. So, uh, if you put your mouth in like kind of a V shape, like if you're about to say the letter V, and then so that again is you do it also layered on top of all those. So, yeah, that, that would be sound <laughs> oh, i don't know dude. if it has a name really but you might as well be speak, speaking like klingon to me right <laughs> like breathe in like how to make a sound <gasps> besides just being like out of breath but were you like at that were you like that at the beginning for me a lot of this stuff was really like intuitive like I, i'm not sure uh, yeah i mean i remember the first sound i was like really stumbled on was was the sound that that the guy who inspired me you know zealous he used to use it like that was like one of his main sounds and i was like how's he doing that and then i remember sitting, sitting down watching the his like tutorial on it, and then I, I got it pretty quick so i don't know for, for me a lot of these sounds just i'm really able to just pick it up pretty pretty quick 